This is a videotape of the caveman holding Fred and Daphne. Maybe that wasn't a live feed after all. This emergency light may have been removed. This seems to... This... The cave... Reading glasses. Could these belong to the person hiding under the caveman's mask? All right. Let's try to solve this mystery. Help me identify the clues that will answer the following questions. Hmm. If the museum's... I'm pretty sure that fake dinosaur bone is covered in crude oil. Maybe the bobbing dinosaurs are really oil pumps. Do you think Monstrous Fred and Magic knew their dinosaurs were being used as oil pumps? The contract. It awards Monstrous Fright and Magic a share of secondary revenues from the museum. They must have known about the oil. One thing puzzles me. When you rescued Fred and Daphne, the video monitor still showed them being held by the caveman. Of course. The caveman filmed himself in front of Fred and Daphne, then fed a loop of the tape through the camera surveillance system to throw us off. Wait, I think I've got it. I think I've got it figured out. Zoinks! There! It's the caveman! Why, hello there!
And I would have gotten away with it, too, if it hadn't been for you meddling kids. It's got to be worth a fortune. Oh, it is. We could make a deal. We don't make deals with criminals, Mr. Grimm. Besides, wouldn't you have to check with your partner first? The one supplying you with mubber? Monstrous fried and magic. Two for two, Fred. Scooby found a contract that points right back to Stanton. And if I'm correct, the answer to Jed's disappearance. Stanton sent us on a wild goose chase. All right, gang, let's fan out and find Winslow Stanton. Cousin, uh, do you mind blasting the rest of this, too? Just as I suspected. Jed was trapped in that costume. She's right. I was framed. I discovered that Stanton was up to no good, so he trapped me in that costume to prevent me from ratting him out. I was in there the first time you came by. Jed, I'm so glad you're all right. Thanks to you, cousin. You won't get away with your lies, Jed. You won't get away, period. It's Stanton. Sounds like he's in the miniature city set.
Well, well, well. Did you really think you'd get away with this? Somewhere. The jig is up, Mr. Stanton. Is it? Like there are two of you. Hmm. Scooby? Hmm. Hmm. Hmm? Mama! It's Marcy. Indeed, Fred. It seems Marcy was trying to frame Stanton, not Jed. Marcy? But why? 
Because I helped create Mother, but you took all the credit for it. I thought that if I gave you a bad name, I could start up my own business. Mr. Stanton, is this true? Marcy, I didn't know you felt this way. You should have talked to me about it. Destroying the reputation of monstrous fright and magic would destroy Mother. I'm sorry if I hurt you, Marcy. I'd like you to become a partner in the company. If you can forgive me, that is. Yeah, I think I can do that. Another mystery solved. Are you coming, Shaggy? Just making myself something for the road. I call it a mother witch. <laughs> huh? What gives? <laughs> now that's what I call a light snack. Ha, 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 ha,